sit a spell with me. This is Katie's E. We are here to help you out. Sit a spell with me. This is Katie's E. Kudzu covers the sound. Kudzu the Musical opens November 8th at the Springer Opera House's McClure Theater. It's a mix of Southern legends, tall tales, and tells the story of fictional WKDZ radio station and its Vine Time Variety Hour. Those stories include a mystery set just across the river in Phoenix City, Alabama. When the smell of whiskey rides the night wind and mixes with cheap perfume, when the guns and the knives and the blackjacks rule the streets, when the slot machines are ringing and the dice are looted, one man rides alone and dares to call Sin City his own. He's a man with a mission, a man on the prowl. He's Frank Cutter, Phoenix City Private Eye. All these characters that are real life people, uh, it's, it's very intriguing to kind of see them come to life and uh, to hear stories about them. Among those characters is the Goat Man, played by veteran actor Carrie Phillips. He, he is at once an enigma and at the same time personable, and that's what I'm trying to portray there with him. The show harkens back to a time before television when radio and sound effects were king. I dug in my pocket for some quarters. We make the sound effects. Uh, a drink in a glass. Uh, a slide whistle. So we're basically uh, making the sound effects for the story. I knew I hit the jackpot. The show features original music by musician and songwriter Alan Levi. And I'm lucky that we have a cast that can like make up harmony on their own. I did write some of it down just to say this is kind of where we start, but uh, but they're doing a lot of that themselves. We can turn the Anything else you'd like to add? I haven't asked you. You know, but you can see me jitterbug in this show. Oh, really? Yeah. Can you show me that now? No. <laughs> so, Pete, if people want to see you jitterbug, they're just going to have to come and get a ticket. <laughs> they're going to have to pay good money.